Well, see we have Bear and his bears out here for company. We got Derg somewhere over there. And we got this fella right here. He's our new friend. He's our we new friend. He's our new friend. What kind of spider is that? That's a woof, woof, woof spider. If he jumps on me, I, I take off my clothes. Don't worry. I worry if you take off your clothes. <laughs> <laughs> worry for me. <laughs> I hear a lot of people says, man, if a spider got in my clothes, I'm getting naked. Whee! Whee! <laughs> All right, well, I just want to show you our friend that's sneaking around. <laughs> well, I'm Ranger Cooking. This is Canteen Cook Day. And what we having is... Dudan, or how you say it? Dudan? Boudin, Boudin. We got... Depending on which side of the bayou you're from. Yeah. Well, that's our canteen cook day today. And we're having sweet tea. Well, it's almost empty. Sweet tea. So I hope we don't die from Kudan. Don't die. Bye bye. Well, here's the. What we have in here is land chops. I'm going to leave the lid off. I think there's no air to the chocos. So we cook a land shop and lagini on our grill. I should let the fire take over the heat up the lagini. I mean the chocos. We out here enjoying our cat meal. Our first cat meal of this season. And everything's doing all right. No rain. A little sprinkle this morning. And that's it. Uh oh, looks like you hit the black. I'm going back and forth with both eyes, see what the left eye dominant. Shoot with my left eye. Damn, he's... Yeah, I'm doing better with my right eye now. As his shot? It's getting better. Alright, I'll see y'all later. This is a uh, little update at the Camp Ranger for the, uh, the Ranger cookie meat. We don't have everybody here right now because some of us are scared. Donnie, where you at? Well, this is an update at the Ranger Cookies Camp. I just put the shower up. The dog is enjoying it. But there's the shower. This tarp comes out so you can step on a tarp and use it as a mat. But this is the update for the Ranger Cookies Camp. Well... I want to do a camp update. The newest item for our camp is this boat or canoe or kayak or whatever you want to call it with the two paddles and the feeling stream life jackets it is added to the addition to the Ranger Cookies Camp. And we also have a new shower system that the bear created earlier. Look at what bear made. He made this with his bear mon. It's a cookie shower. You can take a shower now. Well, the tarp is in the wrong spot. I brought the swimming pool just so you can put your feet in it or whatever, or take a bath or whatever you like. There you go. That's what added to the cookies, the Ranger Cookies place. Your life jacket's in that bucket, sir. I did some camp cleanup. We needed to do it. And just want to show you. What's going on at Ranger Cookies Camp? We're ready to go on a boat trip. Here's Bear's tent. And here's Ranger Cookies' monstrosity. I added this new item so I have a porch. I got a chair. And so I can sit down in the morning or whatever. Or that's about it. This is the update. I just want to show you the whole camp while we're here. And this is my little setup when people come here. Bear. You could at least went to the restroom somewhere else. <laughs> and that's it. I smell smoke. Somebody's on the bayou. Alright, that's the Ranger Cookies update and we ready to go on a bear a berry canoe ride.
What you think, Bear? Very awesome canoe ride. Brand new boat. Field and stream for the fields and the stream. How do you think about the uh, field and stream? Let's do a test about it. What you like about it? I haven't drowned yet, so it works. Yeah. I hate the orange, but we don't get shot when they're hunting uh, gators with uh, elephant guns. If you bring out them elephant guns, you need the orange. And gators are mean. Do you see what they did to, to, to the state park? They're mean. Man. <laughs> there you go. Look at it. Look, it got Molly all over it. You can put all kinds of stuff on this thing. Yep. It'd be heavy as a bitch. Sorry, yep. dog. Your trip is not coming with us. No and let's take a look at it again. We got the feeling stream and the scout. Take a look. And no, I'm not doing videos out there because I didn't bring my camera case for my GoPro. So go over and check out Mr. AK47, also known as Bear videos to see his parts. What kind of parts you gonna have? Bear parts? Oh no, I can't bear it. Look at it. I see. <laughs> Big bear. Oh, parts with water. All right, see you next video. Wait, Derek. For three days we've been out here. We now forgot about these. So the minute we put them out, we've been being bitten by mosquitoes and attacked by mosquitoes until we put this out. Once I put this out, I have no more mosquitoes here. And there's another one on the table. And it's working pretty good too. Now this one's off. I don't feel no heat from it. But uh, I forgot to put these out and we're dying out here by mosquitoes. Well, it's Sunday morning. It's Happy Mor Memorial Day. And don't forget folks, Memorial Day is for our lost soldiers. I want to let somebody else explain that really good for y'all. There's Bears Camp. And it's Sunday. We bought all kinds of goodies and knickknacks. Take a look over here. I'll show you that we bought. Can't believe this four items cost almost $300. God damn. It was $600 and something dollars for this boat. She's all scratched up for our voyages. And this is a... Uh, Memorial Day, we're cooking a good meal. And, uh, what's Memorial Day is all about again? When you get together with your family, we'd like to remind you it's not about the grilling. The family meetup is wonderful, but it's remembering the 18 and the 19 year old soldiers who fought and gave their lives at such a young age, and all the others too. It's not about the grilling, you know, it's great to get with family, but it's remembering the fallen who would otherwise be forgotten. Those young men gave their lives so that nobody attacks us on our soil. And that type of activity is still going on overseas. Today is the day to remember the fallen. You know, these were 18 year old pimply faced kids who fought for you and your family bloodline to still be around today so that nobody attacks us. So me and Kuki ask that you remember our soldiers Say a prayer for them if you want those still fighting overseas. Because they're, they're risking their lives every day they wake up. So you can enjoy your barbecue with, without anybody attacking you and telling you what to do. It's not about the grilling. Loving your family is great. But it's about remembering the fallen who gave all they had their very lives for you. And don't forget, 4th of July is the same thing. Not independent. Independence is our decoration from from one country to another. But today and 4th of July is the day to remember that. I just want to show you our camp real quick. Even though you've seen it a thousand times. It's just an update of the boat back there. It's all scratched up. It's ready for the voyage. And this is what we're having for lunch. Sacombatesi or frates to chicken. Okay. All right, it's ready. I'm ready to pull it up. I'm just going to show you what it looks like. Oh, yes, it's so ready. All right, I'm ready to cookie. See y'all next round. Disintegrate. Yeah. Well, I'm ready to cookie, and it's Memorial Day, and this is the other part what we're doing. What you doing on Memorial Day? We washing the bear. Giving bear his first bath in a long while. He's getting a bath. How you like your bath? Oh, I love it. I love it. 
swamp water in his fur. He's starting to turn. Yeah, so we're giving him bad. A little soap and bear will be okay. He needs to bathe once in a while. Yeah, it looks so cute. Just like a baby in a tub. He's starting to smell like the swamp. Soap will kill it. Let's check out his little uniforms. It's so cute. It's like it's like having a child out here. Uh, I mean, look how cute this is. This is this is his underwear. And he got bear boxers. And he got a little hole for his tail. <laughs> He's got a little backpack. His little jacket and his pants. And he got a hole in the back too. For his tail. For That's what we're doing on Memorial Day besides eating uh, chicken and barbecue. Hope you bear your bait, your bear is in camp. Oh. Bear don't like taking baths, but he's got to do it at least once a year. <laughs> yeah, once a year. It was good timing because he got Where'd some... Where'd you put bear from the rubber ducky? Oh well, <laughs> suffer bear. Poor bear. Alright, I'm Reggie Cookie and this is... Bear taking a bath. Well, rub-a-dub-dub, -dub, it's bear in the tub. You feel better, Bear? Getting that swamp water off you? He looks, he looks, he looks so, starting to turn, Bear. It's bath time. He's starting. It looks so. Look at him. He's so happy taking a bath finally after five years. The downside is Bear's butt and, and his skivvies started smelling like swamp. We had to fix it. Look. Take good care of Bear. He's our friend. Look how happy he is. He's just a happy Bear. Welcome to Cookie Land. <laughs> this is Cookie for Crazy Cookies Camp. Perfect bathtub. Oh yeah, I'm having fun. That's Larry, Duddy. It's okay. I still love it. We're getting the bugs out of Bear's fur. Damn, he weighs a ton. Us wolves room each other. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Bear's bathtub. It's it Bear. Hold, hold, hold your breath. Hold your breath, breath Bear. Wee. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do this to your real babies now. <laughs> Where's Bear at? Ah, <laughs> uh, the camping in the bayou. Bear's first bath in five years. Now he's got bathed in the rain, but it, he needed some soap. Just think about it. Two men in the middle of the woods bathing a bear. <laughs> <laughs> Hope the fish cops don't roll up. What are you, you two doing? <laughs> Give it a bear a bath. Didn't swamp off his butt. No apologies. <laughs> hey, he's my woods friend, and I got to keep him for a long time. Do what you got to do for for bear revival. No one to turn green with mold. Get that soap out your eyes, my friend. Oh, oh it's okay. Can it. I can take it. it. He's a bear. Uh, poor bear. How soggy bears get clean. Ranger Cookies Kitchen Zinc. He looks kind of miserable but happy at the bear, same you're time. Bear naked on camera. <laughs> It's very rare to see Bear naked, but he's, he's naked. Bear naked. It's okay. It's just us men and YouTubers in the woods. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, tubers. Let's wash your face. You, it looks like you got. There you go. You bring the soap. It burns. <laughs> it's not got cleaner. You yeah, see it. that's why I wanted to see. I see a, a brighter snout. Brighter snout. <laughs> Look at between his ears. Uh oh, oh it looks like he, he looks like he's mad now. He's like, Give me a bath. Thank you for giving me a bath, me. The soap, it burns. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ranger Cookie being cookie at, at the Ranger Cookies camp. See what you missed? You missed Bear's bath. Damn you people. See our next video. That's the big red button. Well, what's for dinner? Barbecue ribs. And I took hush puppies and mix it with corn. So we have hush puppy corns. So you just take your hush puppy, hush puppy mix, mix it up, and add a can of corn, and you have hush puppy corn cans. All right, let's take, let's let's find a light over here. So y'all can see the, the most delicious meal. Oh, this day's flashing blue. Why is it flashing blue? Oh, mama love me. All these lights, we can't find one. All right. 
Look at that. Just in case the camera didn't show justice, like I said, take your hush puppy mix, mix it up, put a can of corn with it. And this is what it looks like. It looks like a disaster because I didn't. I'm, I'm quickly making it. When you starve, you don't care. <laughs> and you got children. I don't want to starve. Let's take a look at those ribs again. Just to show you with a flashlight. Make sure you seen that. There you go. Barbecue ribs. Yeah, buddy. We're gonna heat these babies up. We're gonna have ribs in hush puppy mix. Look at that. Mm -mm. Mama gets dinner in the oven. <laughs> See our next part. Well, Bear wanted hash browns, so I made a dish for I can enjoy them too. I don't think you have mine because you have these at restaurants sometimes. We're going to put them right there and let them drain. Just show you the. And we got the ribs over here. We just have to heat them up and they're ready to go. My meals are quick and easy. I don't sit there for 10 hours trying to cook a meal. <laughs> but everybody's different. To keep your dog out of your area when you're cooking, feed him some beanie weenies if you have tons of them. And some, what you call it, devil's food. What you call it stuff? Devil's, uh... They got the tongue and everything and some his own tree. Yeah, potted meat. That keep your dog away from your food and begging for food from your guests, if you have any. It looks like a mess, but that's what he likes. Ain't that right, Dirk? Dirk, oh. Well, this is our first fire at the camp. The reason why we didn't have fires over the three, three or four nights we were here is too hot. All right, there's our first fire. It was a little chill. Well. Well, this is what camp should look like after it's been clean. Only thing I have to do is move that ladder to inside that shed. I have picked up every piece of trash that my guest and me have left. Picked it all up. Tuck in my A-frame bed so it won't get wet. Picked up everything, tied everything up. It's all tied up for the closing season to I come back out and at warm or colder weather. I put everything that can burn in the burn trash. I picked up all and cleaned all the dishes that we had used and stored them. I dumped all the fresh water that we had so it would get stagnated. I bleached. And sanitized the ice chest we used. I cleaned the table. Well, a little bit of some junk, but I gotta clean the table. Before I leave, I'll have that table clean. The kitchen zinc, all the dishes, whoops, I forgot one. All the dishes and the zinc covered to keep it from turning green. It turns green with the green stuff up there. Folded all the chairs and put them underneath the Thing, like discarded trash so people won't say, oh that must be trash and organized and clean the storage shed and put the last tinsel up put all the dishes that we used up so that's it I made sure everything's tied up and hidden especially the most expensive stuff I have out here all hidden. Go for it. I mean, you can try. I got like a hundred buckets. And I noticed it's more cleaner right here. I took away the kitchen zinks and put them up. I have to get rid of those two bags and those two buckets. But it's fine for where it's at now. 
So that's the lockup or lockdown of camp. And I have to say goodbye to the camp. Goodbye. See you next season there, Mr. Camp.